We're gonna pop one of these. Geronimo! Alrighty guys, so welcome back to Ark, where today we are doing the Upper South Cave and going after the Artifact of the Pack. And yeah, so I'm already here, I'm already basically set up, I'm gonna just move this guy a tiny bit out of the way. There's a nice looking Giganto Raptor over there. Ooh, I forgot, GPS does not work. I crafted me up one of those and was trying to use it. I can't use it, it doesn't work. But yeah, that's our guy there. Did I completely forget him? Where did I... You gotta be kidding. I forgot my guy at home. <laughs> I found him. I dropped him. I didn't even notice that I dropped him. Got my guy. Okay, so this cave is fairly easy to find, as you may notice. Here, I'll pop up on the map where we are. It's right in here, and then it's in this clearing, and then it's legit just hidden in those rocks. You can't see it from above, but it's right there. Don't want to drop my guy on top of the Giga Raptor. And it looks like it's messing with this one. I don't want to have to kill it. I will, though. I will if I have to. Don't make me get rid of you. I will. But yeah. So I'm already pretty much set up to go in and do this cave. I got everything I need. Oh, you are following me, aren't you, Larry? Uh, it's, well, you know what, Larry? Uh, land. You gotta be kidding me, Larry. Don't go over there. Larry, where the hell? I want Larry near the door. I gotta get him. I'm just having the best luck trying to start this episode, guys. All we're trying to do is get an artifact today. So that way tomorrow we can go fight the Megapithecus. I already got started on uh, having eggs popped out from the Ceratosaurus. So hopefully that strat works here. So yep, I already got my bile on you. Where's my gloves? Good, I have them on me. I just forgot to... Put them on, or I took them off, I guess, at some point. Okay, so now we're gonna go in with you. I can't see. Hey, buddy. I don't know what that is, but it doesn't sound good. Oh, is this the toxic cave? I don't think this is the toxic cave. That's a dead end, I'm pretty sure. And this way... Is this the right cave? Have I gone into the wrong cave? I feel like I might be in the wrong cave. I don't think I am. So this creature right here is designed to be a caving creature. So it shouldn't fit through most of the cave. Where the hell am I? Oh, this cave looks so different than it used to. So, okay, we got a path. But first problem with that path is that it, I can't fully follow it. Ooh, I got something's aggro. Dude, my man is full on uh, at a 90 degree angle. Jeez. Okay. Whoa! Oh, we made it. We made it. We made it. That was sketchy. I didn't like doing that. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Is that a snake? It is. There's a pink titanoboa stuck on the wall. So... Hello, anyone else? Ooh, nice dung beetle. Oh, 135 and it's green. It's jade like all my uh, helicoprion are. So. Ooh, we got a lot of... Alright, we got a damage buff already. Seriously? Nice. Oh, it's a love bug. That's why. There we go. So, nice part is, is that insects give us damage buff. So we do, like, an insane amount of damage to insects. Nice. Anything behind us? Um. From the sounds of the wings, I'd say that 
that path has uh, some... What, is this a dead end? Is this just like a nook and cranny? This is just a little nook. Oh, I have no clue how to get through this cave anymore. Uh-oh. I don't even think the... Ooh, what is that? That's the love bug. Okay, love bug's down. Let's keep going. We're doing fine. Really? Oh. That's a problem. So. Um. I swear there might have been a fork back here. Was I right or wrong? Um. No, but I don't want to jump. I feel like jumping would be the worst idea. Also, man, are you good? I keep on seeing... Alright, no, you're fine now. Oh, come on. Here's the thing. I can't cryopod him, because then it's going to be like... You, no cryo uh, fridge nearby to pop him out, so... <sighs> okay. We can cryo him to leave. But... Oh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Okay, let the bats all come. We'll deal with the bats first. Okay, bats are dealt with. Um, We'll drop in. Okay, put her back to the wall. Let's get a bug killed here. Head butt away the snakes. There we go. Okay. I think we did good there. Didn't seem to take a whole lot of damage. Um, anything at all down here? I'm wondering if this is just where an artifact's supposed to be. Or can be. Am I even in the right cave, you know? Like, that's my question. I don't even recognize any of this. Let's head up. I think this is right where I got stuck, isn't it? Yep, I got stuck definitely on the other side of this. So, then I'm most certainly supposed to be heading this way. Oh, please don't get any tighter. Because I, I get this guy stuck. I mean, I can push forward. I got, oh, I got like 62 bullets. Got 62 shotgun shells. Oh, geez. Pelovia is down. And I'm seeing an explorer note. Nice. This is Lystrosaurus. Is a small herbivore. Nice. So that's the first one we've seen. Am I still, like, technically entering the cave? I feel like I'm not fully in the cave yet. Okay. Hold up. I'm looking at my map. Two-way split. Three-way split. All right. I think I know where we are now. Um. So, if we head this way, this should be to somewhere. Okay, Titana bows are dealt with. Anything else? If I'm correct, this should be like a water area. Right? Water below. Ooh, I feel like there's something across here, but I... Okay, okay. There's so gators in that water. You hear them? Ooh, snake. Yep, good thing I came across. Here's the, another explorer note. I'm pretty Stand sure... Answers as to why the Megalodons are so territorial. Okay, so... There is technically another way out if we do fall in the water, but it is an underwater path. I should have brought the Baryonyx. But I would know. There's no way I would fit him in. At this point, he'd so be stuck. Okay. Um. 
So as I can see, this path should meet up with the other one at some point. Right? Dung beetle. Yeah. If I'm correct, we'll clear out the path here. I know, because I know, I know I saw a snake, but yeah, this should lead. Yeah, no, this is, this is the other side of that path. Yeah, I know where we are now. We're in the right cave. It's just, it looks so, it's bigger, I feel like. And it looks different. Like, way, way, way different. Like, this cave, I feel like, originally was barren. Like, it was, like, rocks on the walls, some crystals here or there. Now there's just so much foliage. Ooh, snakes. I don't like snakes. Okay. Um, I see another explorer note. But where... Okay. I think I know where we are. Where... Okay, we got a path forward. Not a path to the right. But something that sh should look like one. Yeah. Definitely. And then it should loop all the way around if I had to... Uh, this side. So why not do the loop around here real quick? We'll clear out any baddies that are in or around. Um That's that's a trick path, I'm pretty sure. It should go up and ooh. There's a lot of stuff coming from that way. I killed that uh, dung beetle there just so I could keep my buff up. Because. Ooh, is it onyx? There we go. Get rid of the love bug. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. If I walk this way and up, I can get this explorer note. Seeing the likes of Mammothus Steinkaput alone. Mammoths, okay. Now I'm pretty sure that that should be it. Uh, now, if I'm correct. Um, what I can do here, there's two options. Because I can... Uh, I don't know. I can... I know that there is a way if I can climb up that wall. That we can cheese it. With like a grappling hook or something. There's a Sarko in the water. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Okay. We're going to pop this. We're going to pop one of these. Geronimo! Oh no, the Piranha Swarm! That was awesome. Look at all the Piranha. Okay, we good. We didn't get all the piranha. Ah, I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get those. But what we can do here... Hold up, this guy doesn't have oxygen. Oxygen does not affect him. But I do. Okay. Hold up. I still have oxygen, but he doesn't. That means I need to watch mine. Which also means I could technically take a big gulp of air and then dive. Okay, they're all down. So. I, from the looks of this, I need to swim far side. Now dive. Okay, go straight down, go straight down. 
There's a Sarko down here. He's gonna get gonna get his aggro pretty quick. I'm watching my character's oxygen. Okay, we're worried about our character's oxygen. Now, though, I'm pretty sure if we follow this path as straight as we can. Come on, come on. I see the air. Just have to get to the other side, just have to get up. Get up on land, get up on land. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now, this next one's longer. Oh, this next one's longer. So it bet it goes down and it kind of curves. That's what it looks like. Oh, that's a Sarko. Oh, this is an air pocket. Okay. Oh, there's another Sarko Piranha. Watching my oxygen. Watching his health. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, for a minute there, I thought I was going to get pinned up in the wall by all the piranha. Alright, we're good. We're good. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, now it should be up and like a right, right? I book our, I hang a right. I thought I like hung a right in here somewhere. Ooh, snakes. Alright, here's that intersection. Okay. 150 Titana Boa, nice. If I had Statman with me, I'd check on you. But honestly, guys, I'm coming to a somewhat of a realization. That's that Statman is not that good for uh, some of the creatures I have to get. Okay. So this is the dive to the artifact. There's one little problem, though, with the artifact dive. Um... From what I can tell, it's we go in, and there it, it, there's two ways it branches, so this could go bad. Okay. Okay. I can hear the artifact. All right, this is the left hand hang, the left hand turn. Yep, up, 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 up. Oh, there's the artifact. There it is. Alrighty, okay, we're good. Damn, piranha. I don't like them. Okay, I believe that's all the explorer notes as well. There should only be like three. Here we go. So, ooh, tech boots. We got artifact of the pack. Alrighty, now, please tell me I can get out of here. Alrighty, if I'm correct, there should be just like a drop, like we drop straight down. Yep. Okay, I need to remember where that is for next time. Because when I come back and go get my... Uh, get another one of those. Because... Okay, it's right there. I can legit see where I was supposed to go. Okay. So... Yeah. So when I come back and get another one for the trophy display, that's where I know where to go. And for the shortcut. But, like, honestly, this was a little, like, scary. Because it was like, I don't know where I'm going. I don't recognize this cave at all. It's, like, full-on, like... New... It it's, looks almost brand new. I was completely lost until I got down right here, until this part. Because it, my map, it's like, it's so weird. Because, like, definitely the front part is confusing-er now. And I think it's because of the drop. 
that's what really threw me off is because of when it dropping down here or over not in this room that's that's this is the wrong room whoops uh but yeah no that's that's actually the room that like i was i was thinking all right yeah but well, this is the one because the artifact or not the artifact the explorer note okay That might be a problem. Let's uh, try something here. Can I climb out? I mean, it looks like he wants to four-wheel drive. Yeah, he does. Oh, jeez. He really wants to four-wheel drive. Okay, hold up. I got a plan. Since this man does want a ATV, he's got all-terrain. Ooh, nope. Alright, we might, uh... We might be running out of here on foot. I'm gonna get him up to... Where we were. Where he gets stuck. Right about in here. Yeah. Okay, pop up seven. Oh, I thought I was stuck in the wall for a second. I just kind of got hung up on something. Alright, ooh, I almost forgot. And this is a real bad thing to forget. His two good armor pieces and the bile toxin. I don't need any of that other stuff. Got the shotgun ready. Okay, let's keep on running. We should be able to just run our way out. Usain Bolt this. There's a lot of dead bodies. Okay, okay, yep. This is the area where we jumped. So, ooh, hang on right. Keep on running, keep on running, keep on running, keep on running. This is the area where the mushrooms threw me off. I, for a minute there, with all these mushrooms here, I thought we were going into the mushroom cave. And which, that one you actually have to have, like, certain pieces of armor on. Or, like, the toxic air will start killing you. I think it's, like, gilly, and then you have to have an air tank and all that. Just so that way, you know, you can breathe. Because all the air is toxic, filled with spores and all that. Alrighty. Found my way out, finally. There's Larry. Oh, is it loading or crashing? It's loading. It's hard to tell sometimes. But yeah, that's an artifact done. And the mono helped us a lot. That thing is actually really good in the caves. I'm not going to lie. I half expected it to like need oxygen. But I also was, probably should have brought a Lazarus chowder. So I just didn't have to worry about my oxygen so much. But yeah, we got it. We did it. Now, what I need to do is go finish raising some Serratos. So once I get all those Serratos raised up and imprinted and fully leveled here, we should be ready to do the Megapithecus run. I have all my gear. We, we're ready. I mean, I, I believe we're ready once we get the thing. I'm just going to go steal... Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> my Deodons from over from the Therry army and my Utai. Because those guys are already leveled. And my Utai is not bad at all. So, yeah. Just got to get me 17 Serratos. <laughs> Thank you.